the Weasleys are about warmth and about love and family and heart, and they represent that. Hi, Rochelle. They're the only functional family. Well, although, having said that, the Malfoys are functional, but not in the way we'd like them to be functional. Naughty functional, they are. Sit down, everybody, sit down. But the Weasleys throughout the books and films have always stuck together. <laughs> and, um, there is something definitely special about when all the Weasleys are together doing a family scene because we do kind of all gel like a family, as it were. Yeah, you know, I can remember the first time we met was at King's Cross Station on the first film. It's still such a vivid memory for me, really. I mean, stepping on sort of platform nine and three quarters, and I was about nine years old then. And it was the first film I'd ever done, and, and everything was so new and fresh that day. So it was all a mixture of nerves and excitement. And then all of a sudden you just hear from the back of the train, where are my boys, where are my children? And then Julie came in, that's how we met Julie. Morning, Weasleys! And then we met Mark on the Chamber of Secrets. That's when he came into it. And who are you? And it was just like, click, like it all, it all just came together. Harry. Harry! I'm so thrilled that Mark is playing my husband. We get on really well. I feel that we're almost married, really, now. And uh, with my, my boys and my daughter, it's definitely a family. Yeah! It's unique in that way. There is nothing like it. And they were all these little people when I first started, so there is something lovely about watching the children grow up. Rupert and Oliver and James and I went out for a curry and a pint, and there were some very nice people asking for photographs on their mobile phones. And they asked Oliver and James and Rupert, and then they said, and your dad. Which is very, very funny indeed. We laughed. Good curry as well. Most people think that we just finish filming, go back to the individual trailers or whatever, and that's it, they see each other again on set. Whereas, yeah, like lunch, we eat, we eat together. In between filming, we'll hang out, normally in Rupert's place, because he's got the best gizmos. You know, play a bit of PlayStation, Wii, something like that. Got quite a good room upstairs, and it's got a ping pong table and a dartboard. We're very mature here. So, yeah, there's always something going on. I don't think any of us will ever forget it or ever leave Harry Potter behind. The memories are too strong, I think, for all of us. Ronald Weasley! Gryffindor! This experience has been just an amazing kind of part of my life, and I'll just, I know I'll never, ever forget it, and I'm just proud to be a part of it. We've had some great times and our life has changed since we started. Totally beyond anything we'd ever thought it would do. It's really a special time in our life.